Morning, morning, morning. <coughs> Just a quick one today. Um, we're literally pond hopping. So I thought I'd bring you along just to show you what we do. We've done most of it many, many times, but um, just do a quick little video. So we've got a trailer on for Belgium, but it's not for delivery until tomorrow. Today being Wednesday morning. It's not for delivery until Thursday. And uh, there's a trailer at one of our customers up in Belgium. So what I'm in loaded, half a mile, loaded for me. Left so Bobby. what I'm going to do is drop this one off for somebody else to pick up tomorrow and go tip. Pick a loaded one up out of Belgium for me to come back to the UK. So I should be back in this afternoon, this evening, uh, for delivery tomorrow, I guess. Beautiful morning, <clears throat> seven o'clock in. Uh, oh, I can hardly see the arrows. Um, seven o'clock in Folkestone. I've just been and got some ad blue. I got pulled into the scanner, but the scanner's not working, so they're doing it all manually. Uh, and I thought the queues would be worse this morning up here than they are, so that's it's good that they're not. The train's been running well lately, fair play. That's probably put the curse of death on it now. And like that, we're off. Three, <coughs> excuse me, three minutes I've been sat there. And we're um, getting taken up for a train. I have got uh, Civep this morning, which is bound to slow things down. <laughs> Turn left on to Barbara. Anyway. He's missed the arrow for the train. Right, that's us across and coming off the train. So now we're going to head to Civet, get our um, <coughs> veterinary checks done and customs paperwork sorted. Where we'll probably be for quite some time doing these boys. <clears throat> Doesn't look to be a lot of trailers here, which hopefully will be a good thing. Maybe we'll be in and out in decent time, but we shall see. Could be five minutes, could be five hours. Well, no, it won't be five minutes. Could be 20 minutes, could be 20 hours. That's more realistic. way through to the front here. It's a fit with a curtain drone, that's unusual. They don't they don't like you staying overnight and uh, they must have been fairly delayed to run out of time totally. But anyway, there we are. Right, we'll take the paperwork in, try and get sorted. See you in a minute. Okay, here we are. We've been pulled onto a bay. Number five. There's the parking area where I was. And we've just been uh, all on to bay five. We leave the doors shut for the moment because they just do a seal check because they're too lazy to walk up there and check the seal on the back of the trailer so you have to back it on the ramp for them. So they can just walk across the office warehouse floor and check the seal. What they may do from there is they'll either tell me, okay, parking, which means go back up there and park up. Or they'll say, open chef, please. In which case, you pull forward, break the seal, open the doors and back on. They'll then take some of the goods off and check it, or they may strip the whole lot out or whatever. Um, 
then reload it then you have to pull forward shut the doors drop back on and they reseal it and then they'll tell you to go to parking so we're just waiting for the shout to either way now well that's a bit of good news Done the seal check and I can return to parking. At the roundabout, take the second exit to Boulevard de Lay Road. Just nip back up here. And uh, wait for them to either call or bring the paperwork to me completed. And then I'll be able to get on my way up to Belgium. Take the second exit in to Boulevard Belgium. de Lay Nice morning. Let's vamos. Or Allez, as they say in France. Well, good run up to here. We're just um, probably a mile and a half, uh, or two miles from my <coughs> trailer swap. Done it in. Uh, just over an, uh, an hour and a half. Normally it takes about an hour and three quarters, so it's about right. Um, we'll go up here now, drop this trailer off, put the notes somewhere safe, and pick up our next trailer, which is for delivery in High Wycombe tomorrow morning. Okay, trailer change done. We're uh, just on the outskirts of Calais, got 15 more miles to go. <clears throat> Everything running so far so good. Just got to see what the train's like now when we get there. Hopefully we get a quick crossing. Um, and then from there I'll make my mind up whether to run up to uh, Ashford for the night. Again, which I'm a bit sick of to be honest. Or uh, Beaconsfield Services which would be my preferred option, but I want to get there within a 13 hour shift so I can have 11 off and save my um, save my nines for the back end of the week because I think I'm going to need one tomorrow by the sound of it and I'm likely to need my driving time as well because I've got to tip High Wickham, Lord Peterborough, tip Avonmouth and I'm guessing from there because I've got a railer on, which means it's got meat hooks in the roof, I'm likely to end up going up to Merthyr, booking off and having my time off, ready to pull one out of there Thursday evening. No, Thursday tomorrow, Friday, something like that anyway. Uh, the last bit is pure guesswork. I don't know as yet. Um, um, other than tipping High Wycombe, Lord and Peterborough for even about, I don't know. But uh, yeah, as I say, we're on our way to Calais, so I'll show you the last couple of miles when we get a bit closer. Here we are then, back in familiar territory and back Take where we started this morning. On the right to E15. Then uh, I was right. hoping to get here for half past two and it's actually 26 minutes past. So uh, that was a pretty, pretty close. 
Lost gas, wasn't it? As I'm sure you're aware, we've done this Keep bit. Right, three fifteen. Channel Tunnel. Find departures now, which is the 
pond hopping goes, that's it. We've been across, we've swapped trailers, and we're back in the UK. Sorry, it's such a short one. Uh, should have something better uh, next week when I'll be probably doing a um, cross channel ferry from Portsmouth to Cam and then two or three drops in Brittany. So that should be quite interesting. Um, and it's it's during the day. Uh, well, we should be out during the day. Um, and then uh, tipping on days as well, uh, early morning. So it may be a bit dark, but uh, I'm sure you'll get the gist of it. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you're not subscribed, please, please do so. It really does help the channel grow. Uh, thanks for all your support. Any questions you've got, stick them in the comments below. And thanks once again. Stay safe.